Hi guys, today I want to show you a feature that's available in Business Central called the Payment Reconciliation Journal. Right now I'm logged in as a business manager, so I'm just going to go to Cash Management and Payment Reconciliation Journals. And I've already got one started for my checking account, and this is to be used to import data that's come into your online banking. So I can import a file, and that can also be automated um, to go ahead and reach out and grab a file. And I've turned on a process for um, automatically applying upon import, but you can also override that and do the auto apply. So that basically the file comes in and you just do this apply. And what it does is it goes through the, the entries that are in your system and compares them to what you brought in from the bank account. And it basically matches them up with what they think is accurate um, for application purposes. And it gives you a match confidence. So what you'll need to do is once you've imported that file, You'll just go through and um, verify that these are correct, make some changes and adjustments, and then you'll post the batch when you're completed, and that will actually close out any bank ledger entries. They will no longer be open, and they won't show up in your bank rec. So let's talk about sort of this match confidence. This is a medium match confidence, and I'm just going to go ahead and click on it. And what it's done is it's basically looking at all my open entries and it's saying this is the amount that came in from the bank and we've applied it to this line. Well, this looks acceptable to me. It seems like this is the correct application. So I want to go ahead and accept this application. Once I do that, I'm just going to refresh my screen by pressing F5. My match confidence is now accepted. We also have transactions that could come in that maybe it's um, from a customer we've never done business with before and I need to map this text that came in from the bank to the corresponding customer in the system. So I'm just going to click on this line and then click the manual application map text to account. So now when I do that, it shows me the text that came in from the bank and then it gives me some options here and I'm going to go ahead and say this is mapped to a customer and down here, if I do a search, you'll see that this is the customer. Um, when I do a search, I can find the name and I can map it. It might not be the same name and that's why you would manually map it. There we go. And now this has been applied to this particular customer and this is a high match confidence. Right. It did find entries in the system to apply this to for this particular customer. Again, once you've gone through the entire batch, all you'll need to do is do posting. And that post action will post the reconciliation for those entries. And again, this can be done on a daily basis. The file can be um, triggered to basically reach out to the bank on an hourly basis if you want to keep bringing things in. Um, and it just makes the application process a lot easier, especially for transactions that maybe you weren't aware of. This works for bank fees. Um, maybe you've got customers paying direct deposits to the bank. And so you haven't uh, recorded that information yet. You'd be able to use this to, to, do, um, to bring in those transactions and to apply them if there's something that's already out there. That's it. I'm going to go ahead and uh, also include a link that gives you more information on this and how the setups work. And I uh, hope you enjoy it. Thanks for watching this Archer Point video. If you found it helpful, make sure to check out our website and blog at www.archerpoint.com. Additionally, if you have any questions regarding our products, services, or information in this video, feel free to email us at info at archerpoint.com. Thanks.